in this question we are given that a ball is gently dropped from a height of 20 meter now ball is gently dropped it means initial velocity of the ball is zero from a height of 20 meter if its velocity increases uniformly at the rate of 10 meter per second square so 10 meter per second square is the rate of change of velocity so it is an acceleration with what velocity will it strike the ground so we are to calculate the final velocity after what time will it strike the ground so we will have to take we will have to calculate the time taken by the ball before it just strikes the ground okay so initial velocity of the ball is zero meter per second acceleration the rate of change of velocity is 10 meter per second square displacement covered by the ball just before it touches the ground is 20 meter okay and we are to calculate final velocity <coughs> of the ball just before it touches the ground and time taken by the ball to reach the ground let us consider Newton's equation s is equal to ut plus half at square s is the displacement it is 20 u is 0 time taken is t we are to calculate it half of the acceleration acceleration is 10 and t square so it is 20 is equal to 5 t square or you can say t square is 4 mathematically we can find values of t are plus 2 and minus 2 but t here representing the quantity time and time cannot be negative so t is equal to minus 2 is not possible so value of t is 2 seconds now consider another equation which is v is equal to u plus at v is the final velocity of the ball just before it touches the ground or you can say final velocity after two seconds because ball is going to touch the ground just after two seconds so v is u which is zero a into t a acceleration is 10 time t is 2 so value of t is 20 20 is 20 meter per second so final velocity of the ball is 20 meter per second and it and it will take two seconds to reach the ground